I'm Lauren Redville. And I'm Charlie Durbin. And we're, we're going, going to Orlando. Orlando. Where are we going, Ian? We're going to Disney World! <laughs> are we, though? I don't think we are. Where are we going, So we're going to downtown Disney. We're going to downtown Disney. We're at Disney Springs. <laughs> going to find some lightsabers. Probably some food. Downtown Disney is an outdoor shopping, dining, and entertainment complex at the Walt Disney Resort in Bay Lake, Florida, near Orlando. We're here in the world's largest Disney store. Charlie, what made you choose this outfit style? You know, I was like, Orlando's warm, right? So, luckily, I was like, That's true. And shorts. That's true. Like, Why not? But, but you then know, it's cold. So. Yeah, it's good. We're wearing sweatshirts. <laughs> It's about 10 o'clock and a lot of us just got up, but um, it's game day, so get pumped, go X, and we have a big day planned. Uh, it starts about 3.30 when our report time is to go to the arena, but before then, we are missing school for this trip, so a lot of us are doing homework right now. Let's go! This is the end of 321. Say goodbye, everyone. Bye. We're leaving today. And then we're going to go play some music and beat Florida State. We're not exactly the favorite for this game, but we're going to win because go X. A six mile junior from Lakeville. It's halftime during the Xavier Florida State University basketball game, and we are up by 10 points. This, this impossible sweet 16 action happening right now, so this is pretty insane. Let's go, X. This is hot, so we beat Florida State, and we're going to. Oh, we're going to Florida State! 
Lynch. Mm -hmm. How do you feel about today's win? Very pleasant. How does it feel that you're taking your band to the Sweet 16 on your first year? Elated. <laughs> it's pretty late. It is 1 a.m. We are no, back. It's like 1.30 a.m. It's 1.30 a.m. My bad. It is 1.30 a.m. But we are back in northern Kentucky and we're driving back to campus and the journey will continue. I'm Lauren Ritho. And I'm Charlie Durbin. And, and we're, we're going, going to San, San Jose. Jose. Arizona game in four hours. <laughs> we're ready now. Yeah, we're ready. Yeah. We're yeah. pumped. Yeah. Oh, we're getting packed. Just played some music. Oh, See the people. They're getting hyped. It's going to be a good game. Let's go. game tonight, tonight, this afternoon. Unfortunately, the season did not end as we had won it. The final score of the game was 83-59 Gonzaga. But after a rough year, the Xavier men's basketball team completely exceeded our expectations. They had an amazing run and had their third Elite Eight appearance in program history. Our last visit to the Elite Eight was nine years ago. It was inspiring to watch the Musketeers play so hard after the heartbreaking loss last year when Wisconsin knocked us out of the tournament during the second round in St. Louis. It was an exciting year and we're looking forward to see what this team is capable of within the next three years. This was an unforgettable experience and we hope you enjoyed watching as much as we enjoyed our time traveling.